My name is Joseph Mwangi, and I want to demonstrate to us how to identify our IP addresses, our DHCP server address, our DNS server, and how to use the ping to troubleshoot. I'm using a Windows 10 device, and the first thing you do is to go to this command prompt. You run as an administrator. Once you run as an administrator, you can maximize the screen. The first command we write is ipconfig slash all. Then you press enter. It will detect, it will give you the list of the IP addresses assigned to your device. Uh, from my device here, you could see that my IPv4 address is 192.168.67.194. That is preferred because it has been issued by the DHCP server and it has a list time. It, it, it was list, it was given on this time and it expires on this time. And then it shows me my DHCP server address, and my default gateway, which also happens to be my DHCP server, and the DNS servers. To check connectivity issue on any of these interfaces, you can use the ping command. So you type ping and then I can start with my own uh, Network interface 192.168.67.194. I press enter. So it sends four packets and expects to receive them. And it has sent four packets, it has received four, so there is no loss. And because it is an internal uh, NIC card, so it, it did within milliseconds, so there was no time even spent uh, on that. Now to check connectivity via the default gateway, then I do ping 192.168.67.1, press enter. It again sends four packets, and uh, the average is 76 milliseconds, and there is no loss. So my default gateway is working. The last item I want us to check is our DNS server if we can be able to reach it from our device. So we will ping uh, DNS server. This is the Google server 8.8.8.8. .8 I press enter and it has spent more time, TTL, time to leave, and it has spent 158 milliseconds, but it has sent four and lost none. So that means that connectivity is working. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, we have more lessons on this in the next videos. Thank you.